Hi, this is Krishna Merchant and thank you for joining us for the market roundup. The Indian markets ended at an all time high today again after touching an all time high last week on that goal for buying in uh, the banking shares and also the rally in San Pharma and Ranbaxy following the announcement of the deal. The Sensex was uh, up 2% to close at 22,702 and the Nifty ended at 6,796. Uh, yesterday, the International Monetary Fund upgraded India's growth forecast for FI15 to 5.4% and also FI16 to 6.4%. Among individual stocks, Sun Pharma shares uh, were, were the top gainers with 7% gain uh, and uh, ran back to shares rallying almost 5% uh, after they announced uh, uh, that Sun Pharma was acquiring ran back to for around 3.2 billion. Most brokerages are upbeat on uh, Sun Pharma uh, on the synergies between the two companies following the deal. Uh, investors also regained appetite for blue chip shares, especially the banking stocks. Uh, amongst them, Axis Bank and ICICI Bank, they were the top gainers up 4% each, and State Bank of India rallied 3%. From the smaller banks, Indian Bank was up 10%, South Indian Bank and Union Bank gained around 7% each. Top losers were the IT shares, TCS and Infosys, both were down around 1%. Uh, Infosys will be announcing results for the March quarter on Tuesday, kick-starting the earnings season. Among other stocks, Tata Steel closed up 3% uh, after the company uh, sold its Australian subsidiary to a New Zealand company, uh, Steel and Tube Limited, for around 143 crores. Suzlon Energy was up around 7% after its German arm got a loan of around $1.2 billion. Jet Airways shares rallied uh, over 6%. Today, at Hub is presenting the case in front of Seb Sebi on why it should not make an open, op open offer to Jet Airways. Uh, among uh, markets have uh, rallied uh, and uh, the Nifty is trading close to 6,800 level. Technical analysts are saying that any close above 6,800 would lead to further upside. Of course, uh, the election outcome and also the earnings season are key indicators to watch out for. That is all for today. Do stay tuned to livemin.com for more updates.